Now in the first part then of this question, what we've got to do is fill in these two values here. Very easy. All you've got to do is substitute x equals 1 then into this equation here to get y and the same applies for x equals 1.5. If you do that, put 1 in here, 1 cubed is 1, add 1 is 2 and you've got 1 times the square root of 2. Do that on your calculator and you should find you get 1.414. Do the same again, just put x is 1.5 through here, do it on your calculator and you should find you get 3.137. Don't forget to round these up though to three decimal places. Now for the next part though, what we've got to do is get a rough approximation then to an integral. The integral in this case of x going from 0 to 2 of x times the square root of x cubed plus 1 integrated with respect to x. Now whenever you do an integral, what you're essentially doing is finding out the area under a graph. Bounded by your limits, in this case 0 to 2, of your graph y equals, in this case, x root x cubed plus 1. And they actually give us a sketch of this, so it's a sketch something like this. Okay, we'll just do it in here. We're integrating from 0 to 2, and so we're trying to find out essentially this area underneath the graph. And we do that by an approximation using the trapezium rule, where we divide this up into lots of strips. If you're not familiar with the trapezium rule, here it is, okay, that the area under the graph, which is basically this integral, is just roughly the width of a strip divided by 2. Now these strips, okay, we can see from the table what the widths are going to be. They're going to be half a unit. You can see from 0 to 0 0.5, 0 0.5 to 1 and so on. They're half a unit. So you've got strips in here. If I can just put them in, you've got that one at 1, you've got another one here at 0 0.5 and you've got another one up here at 1.5. So you've got to do the width of a strip divided by 2, and you've got to do the first height, which is this height here, which happens to be 0. And you've got to do plus twice the sum of all the middle heights. That's the height of this, plus that height, plus that height. These y values, in other words, plus the last height, this height here, which is going to be 6. So all you need to do is put these values into this formula. So we can say that this is approximately going to be half the width of a strip. So the width of a strip, as we said, is 0 0.5 divided by 2 and then big square bracket. First height, the first height, this one here in the table is 0 for this example. Plus twice the sum of all the middle heights. That's all these green ones here. So that's going to be 0 0.530 just pop that in, 0 0.530 plus the next height, 1.414 plus the next one, 3.137. Close the bracket off and then it's plus the last height, the height here, which is 6 units. So plus 6. Get on your calculator, work that out and what you have is that that comes out at 4.0405. And we're requested to give this to three significant figures, so basically this is going to be 4.04 .04 to three significant figures. And there you go, that brings us to the end of this part of the question.